I'm not even sure if I'm showing um, with this lens but hi good morning my loves welcome back to my channel today it's a Monday it's a new week my voice is sounding a bit hosy because it's the morning and uh, yeah I just woken up and I'm using the lens that I've been referencing to which is the standard kit lens um, that fell it literally zoomed out it's completely zoomed out and when you when I come close I'm not sure if you guys can see but when I come close it's like it zooms out I'm not even that close now it's like it zooms out the middle of my face and then like when I'm standing here it's like you know like a rounder lens it's like the middle is zoomed out and then it you know goes thin <laughs> but yeah we are not here for that we are starting a new vlog and uh, as you have seen as you would have already seen I mean from the previous uh, from the heck am i saying <laughs> like yeah but like what i was saying um is you guys would have seen on the previous vlog i got my new baby here which is my stepper and this week i am planning on starting to use it there's this lady that i followed a while ago not sure if you guys will be able to see on my tablet but this channel right here I'm not sure if this thing is focusing, but she does step her exercises like full body workouts um, on a step her and uh, she has like a 15 minutes one and then I downloaded this 15 minutes one, there's a 30 minutes one and also there's like um, a 45 minutes one. I want to start slow, start with 15 minutes, go 30, then go 45 until I get used to the thing and I get my balance. So this morning we're going to be working out child and testing out my muscles i know this thing is gonna be burning and it's gonna be difficult because it's literally been a very long time since i've actually exercised so yeah it's really gonna be difficult but let's get on it let's get on it and to those of you who are new to my channel welcome welcome i hope you do subscribe i hope you do enjoy my content and you do subscribe and join part of my family and for those of you who've been here the ogs the day ones thank you so much for sticking by and staying being part of my channel and my family um let's start exercising guys because i think i'm wasting time now so I'm just going to put my tablet right here so that I can be able to see it and follow this lady. Uh, so 15 minutes, we're only doing 15 minutes workout like I said. I'm wearing my trucks, I'm just, I'm not going to be wearing sneakers, it's early morning guys and uh, the trucks will do it. Hey? When I used to walk on the walk pad, I would walk with trucks, trucks are comfortable shoes. They also suitable for most conditions. I don't know if this light behind me is like literally making me darker because I really cannot see this camera is zoomed out so I can't see if you guys can see me. But just a quick bit check. This is where I'm at. I just wait myself. I'll attach a picture as proof somewhere here. It literally looks like the one that is on my screenshot the other day. Literally still on 75. This is nine days after I took that picture. So it's like really being pescatarian. It's just maintaining me at 75 and I want to lose more. So I'm going to try to control portion some more because I mean we've been going ham in this past week like a bit not with portions just that we've been also having sugar cocktails and stuff like that you know so I'll try to reduce on sugar and incorporate exercise and uh, yeah let's get started um, with this video and do the talking later so I'm just gonna okay um, she also uses these parts so I'm just gonna have them in hand uh, in case in case we're gonna use them at some point here but I'm gonna start the video so I did not speed up the first few clips um, of this workout because I wanted you guys to see how actually slow I was when I was doing this it really was hard and I was really slow so I just I didn't speed up these few clips and then I think I'm gonna do the same I'm actually yeah I'm gonna do the same on like day five workout so that you guys can see the difference because there was literally a difference on how I move like the first day was exhausting as you guys are gonna see um throughout the video and then um, the rest of the days I'm just gonna speed up because it's the same thing I just kept doing the same thing every day I'm gonna link the channel that I'm using for these workouts on the comment section down below because I don't think you guys were able to actually see that um, when I showed you on my tablet here on stream 
but yeah this was day one it was very difficult <laughs> i was very slow so let's um see how i'll be performing um on day on day five because like i already said i'm gonna fast forward the rest of the days not fast forward but like just speed them up so that it's not like um you guys are watching the actual workout on my channel um but watching rather my progress on how i perform um on different days but um for the entire workout you can just go to the um to the youtube channel that i already said i will link on the description box and then watch for yourselves and join in on this fitness journey also i apologize and i um what is it in advance um because whenever i'm on my step it gets darker it's like the camera lot would lose focus um of my face and then it gets dark so it's going to be like this so you should be throughout the video so i'm so sorry for that but you can still see me and you can still see that i am there working out um, throughout the face but yeah let's continue watching the video guys Guys, we're almost there. Oh my god, at least I missed 15 seconds Three, of the two, 15 minutes. Work out, check it out. Uh, just oh. sorry about that. Just want to show you guys the numbers on the step. I got them as I'm dying. Yeah! <sighs> so those are the numbers. Let me turn it from this direction. So those are the numbers from the stepper. I had 168 steps. Well, excluding the lunges and whatever not that's out there and at 7 minutes 43 thing is so that was the time on the step at the rest of us squatting and doing lunges let's see how many calories I bent <laughs> only 24 oh my word so yeah 24 calories that I bent you know what I know it's not that much but I did something I moved and right now it's really about pacing myself to getting back 
into being fit because this unfitness sucks it sucks guys when you're unfit oh, I am so dead I'm so tired but anyways I'm running out of time let me hop into the shower and get ready for work actually because I don't think I'm going to film after that I'm leaving my camera before I go to work Woo. I still can't catch my breath let me just show you guys um, the food we prepared for this work or for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday because we prepare for three days and then we cook at gate Wednesday afternoon for for like Thursday, Friday and Saturday and then we cook again Sunday and so on and so forth so I want to show you guys what we're having this week like I said I'm pescatarian now oh, do you think that we still need to pick away the step I'm really tired like I said, I'm pescatarian, but for this week, my man wants a chicken. We've been eating prawns, fish, and stuff. And when we're on a fast, obviously, it's all plants. There's nothing like meat and stuff like that. So I'm just going to show you on my scarf tin that I just picked up from the fridge. Obviously, I'm going to add other things. But yeah, this is what we cooked last night. Um, what's happening? Ooh. This is what we cooked last night so there's some mixed veggies then there's a butternut and then there's a chicken breast so i'm gonna make like a salad we like to make our salad like in the morning i'm gonna make like a tomato green pepper chilies onions like a salsa salsa oh my word i'm so tired i'm sorry like a salsa kind of thing like but add a whole full tomato with some feta with cucumber and uh I'm sorry, I don't even know where to hold the camera. I'm so dead. <laughs> I'm so tired. But yeah, I'm gonna make the salad. I just mentioned the salad. Oh my word, guys. But yeah, it's gonna consist again, just to be precise now. A full tomato. I like tomatoes, so I always take it for one. A full tomato, cucumber, feta, and chilies and onions. So, like a salsa kind of thing like I already said I keep repeating myself but yeah I was just out of breath I'm feeling like a bit less out of breath now and then yeah it's literally gonna be filling and then on the side I will have an apple and water and maybe some dried cranberries like to snack if I need to like if I feel like it like to have some dried cranberries but most of the times I come back home still with my uh, container like full or half full excuse me with them so that's what um i'll be eating today guys let me go shower i'm gonna run late if i don't i'll see you tomorrow same place same time okay bye oh my word the overwhelming light on the background is drawing with the focus okay we adjust it good morning hi guys good morning so today is tuesday it's the morning um of a tuesday and uh right now it's half past seven it's about to be load shedding literally at eight until it's from eight until half twelve i mean for somebody who wakes up at like seven or even eight like when there's no work that's almost half a day gone bro like Yo, we inhale, we inhale. So I'm deciding to start with things that will require a stove. That's why I'm here before I step on my stepper. So there's this mixture that I make using lemons and ginger. Literally every week I just make it and put it in the fridge and then I drink like a cup in the mornings and in the afternoons. It really helps to detox. It also helps with my gut health i think because it literally like for the past two days i didn't make it i don't know why okay because weekend was a bit hectic i think um because the lemons okay i didn't have lemons but my husband got lemons um when he went to get my step on sunday um which you guys have seen by now and it's on the previous weekend vlog so he got the lemons but after cooking sunday like no prepping and unboxing the stepper i remember there was load shedding again so 
I couldn't make it and then I was so tired because on Saturday I didn't sleep literally a wink turns out okay not it turns out let me talk while working so what happened there was we went out um, if you guys have watched I think I'm gonna do two and a half, one and a half now so if you guys watched my weekend vlog um, you would have heard me saying that we went out and if you're on my Instagram you will see um, the photos of us um, having gone out I'll also attach a picture of this devil that's a devil cocktail <laughs> I even told the story and I'm just already on this cocktail so we went to Roku Mama's and there's this red um, red bull cocktail there my husband ordered me that because when we got there I went to the bathroom first thing after the coffee shop date and then he ordered himself some beer because he wanted to watch some football and then ordered me that Red Bull cocktail. It was nice. I won't lie. It was nice. And I saw, okay, it's a Red Bull cocktail. But it didn't click on my mind. When you went to a coffee shop earlier, and then now I was drinking a Red Bull. I, I had iced coffee, and now I was drinking a Red Bull. <laughs> you guys can already see where this is going. I was drinking a Red Bull um, cocktail, and guess what? I had three of those. And in my head, it wasn't clicking that that's just caffeine overload. <laughs> and uh, by at the end of the day, I really I couldn't sleep, bro. I was trying to figure it out, like what's happening? Why am I not sleeping? I drank warm milk. Warm milk. I mean, like I wasn't sleeping. My husband's five alarm for when he goes to work went off. I was up. No sharing came and went back. I was up, bro. <laughs> It was frustrating. My 6 a.m. alarm went off. Like, but that's the last alarm I remember because after switching it off, my husband tried to like cuddle me and like soothe me to try to fall asleep. So yeah, I fell asleep at around past six. And then on top of that, my body is used to getting up literally at six. So around like quarter to nine, I remember it was 8.40 something. So it was like quarter to or 20 to 9 or oh, but it was 40 something. I woke up, Bruce. Like I, I got up. I was up. I was fully awake. But I was like, are you sure? You know, I'm like, I want to. Like I want to, but like my mind is fully awake. So yeah, I got up and continued with the day. Like, but I feel like it's hitting now because yesterday I went to bed around what? Okay, my alarm to go to bed, not an alarm, you know that thing of like time for bed setting on an iPhone, it goes off at 10. So by the time it was going ding, 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 it's bedtime, I could hear my phone, but I was already half asleep in bed. So I went to bed early and I woke up like now, like my, the, the Bible verse notification at 7 woke me up and oh, my alarm woke me up, but I just switched it off and went back to bed. And then at 7 when the Bible verse thing came in, then... I got up but yeah man i'm still kind of feeling it that i'm not fully rested this is the lemon i did one and a half i think i should do the other half yeah, let me just do the other half because it's just gonna sit there since we didn't make any seafood we usually use it there to squeeze onto fish or onto whatever we had made that we like with lemon um for meal preps for that week but for now we still have our chicken um, that I showed you guys. When did I show you? I showed you yesterday morning. So today is Tuesday and tomorrow will be the last day with the chicken breast. So I'm just gonna pop that into the pot. You guys don't need to see the pot. It's just a pot with water. So I put lemon and ginger and that's it. And then you bring it to boil and as it starts to boil, this I saw on YouTube. And it was on those hacks, you know, how to lose weight quickly. <laughs> isn't gonna work but i know that lemon and thingy i like lemon basically lemon water but with ginger i wasn't sure but it is i like the mixture and i can feel the difference it makes on my body it loosens my bowels makes me feel good generally and even if like let's say in the afternoon i'm hungry before bed because i take it before bed once i drink this thing hunger goes away and i'm good even in the mornings it's like it could be very helpful for someone who's like on an what is it intermittent fasting if you struggle to control yourself when you get hungry you just drink this thing 
it kind of blocks the hunger for a little while there and then you can eat maybe after 10 or so but that's just me generally i always like would grab an apple or something at around 10 or yogurt we didn't get yogurt we don't have yogurt my husband forgot i need to go get some yogurt for us but yeah man this is my morning today kind of slow i think i don't know if it's slow maybe it may seem so for you guys but for me it's like yeah this is how i'm feeling it's a normal day basically i'm just trying to pull the harder parts of the ginger i never pull the whole thing i mean you ikoji goji so i can't really get onto all the grooves of the plant so i just pull the thicker parts that have thicker skin and the other parts that i feel like they are were rotting and then yeah <sighs> i'm so tired man i'm gonna get on my stepper after this um while this thing is boiling probably electricity will cut me while i'm like busy with it but yeah uh, I don't mind because I don't have much that needs electricity that need I will also in water shedding like water is coming out in dots by dots That's why I had to do this thing boil it now while I can get some water and then Me I will wash I will be able to wash mine. It's coming out I'll just bath instead of showering and let it dot and dot until Yeah Till kingdom come Oh Another thing I wanted to tell you guys about was um, was a decision on the step. I'm not sure if I told you guys why I got a step. Okay, I got it to exercise, obviously. But why specifically the stepper? I got the stepper specifically because I want a tone. Like, I love how my body is looking, except for the tummy. And the arms, they just, they too round. You see when I want them to be like this when they like this, not this roundness. You see when it's hanging like there's a bit of definition so i want to have that definition even when i'm just standing and also my face is way too round so i'm doing cardio on the stepper and but mostly it tones you like yes it's cardio because you guys saw how exhausted i was yesterday and how i'm about to get because even though that thing is 15 minutes it killed me i'm feeling it like i'm really feeling it on my legs maybe my form is not right yet or what on my arms and stuff like that but i'm feeling it and i know with time i'm gonna get there everything will get correct and i will adjust to more time so the reason i got the stepper specifically is because i want to tone like i like my thighs like i'm not not in love with this body like i i don't like other parts i don't know what i'm trying to say okay i know what i'm trying to say i just don't know how to put it so that you guys understand but what i'm saying is i don't hate this body especially after my wedding like i've been saying this after i fitted those dresses and i saw how beautifully it helped me of course when i sit down the tummy would be more visible and then i wouldn't like that a bit but when i'm standing everything is just it was nice i loved it and i enjoyed it you know so it's like i don't have that thing that i absolutely hate this body i don't you know because i think i've been like that before <laughs> i think i've been like that before but i'm kind of like i'm into the curves I'm into the curvy body but i want to tone it down and i want to get down man i really i want to lose some fat especially here arms tummy and here okay here neck is the same part i think it's the same place so i'm done um i'm done chopping everything just gonna put the stove on and let it simmer so yeah man i wanna tone i really i wanna tone i know i have like a lot of muscle well maybe it's not that lot anymore because when you lose sometimes and you're not exercising you lose muscle mass as well but when i used to lift weights i know i had a lot of muscle and now when i start losing weights i can see still some definition underneath oh i'm wearing my sweat belt from hope feet as well today you guys are gonna sit properly when i'm on the stepper but yeah what i'm saying is like i can see like like this what i was showing you like okay the cellulite the arm is like there 
but like underneath i don't know if you don't mind tell me like those two lines i used to have because i never had a six pack okay i had a two pack up here it was not that visible but you know that two pack and then i had the lines like the mud that shows this muscle here so they started showing now and even on my thighs when i lift my thigh and i'm not just standing then those muscles like the visibility how i used to be shaped to be shaped i mean they show so i still believe that i have that muscle mass you know and like on the scale i'm heavier than i look sometimes i feel like that but you guys can correct me and it could be bone mass as well not sure but i just believe because i used to lift weights i still have the muscle i gained when i used to lift a lot so yeah i want to tone that's why i got the step up and also i had this thing on jessica i also went to check jessica van hayden go subscribe on her channel i really love her she's cute which is really cute and amazing i follow her everywhere but yeah i had this thing on here and i also went to check it out on google that if you burn like seven thousand seven thousand seven hundred calories um that amounts to like one kgs of fat like it's equivalent to one kgs of fat so if you burn those calories that means you've burnt approximately one kgs of fat hear me out like fat just it's like fat like in my understanding that clicked as in like when you lose weight of course you lose like water weight when you go to the you know in the mornings when you hop on the scale and then you sit and do your thing in the toilet then when you come up and you weigh yourself again like a few grams go down there so that's another weight that you lose <laughs> like in a way that's a reality you know you know that okay after you lose that's why sometimes i weigh myself after eating and if i'm still on 75.2 after eating then i'm like oh that means i'm there like that's the weight for me but yeah you guys get what i'm trying to say or oh, i don't know if you get it but what i'm trying to say is you can lose water weight you can be bloated and you lose the gas it can just be your fecal mass you know all those things but and fat loss and muscle loss as well you know when you're losing weight on the scale so it's like it's not pinpointed that okay you lost this um, kind of mass weight so for that thing when it said it's fat it's like specifically fat and i want to lose fat you know so i'm like i need to burn like at least in a week 7700 i think jessica is doing that as well i think she said on her vlog that she's trying to do that have the 7700 as her weekly goal and then she knows that in that week she at least spent like one kgs of fat like more or less you know so that's what i'm trying to do <laughs> but yesterday my husband and i planned to go working like after work but we didn't do that because it was raining and yeah so we couldn't go working so now what i'm thinking because about to be low shedding i don't have much to do it's a few dishes because we cooked sunday with no preps and stuff so it's just cups for tea and the things for when we make our salad to mix onto our food and what and the knife and the tray that i just used and then yeah just to sweep i can't do laundry i mean the few laundry things we have and right like there's literally nothing oh and editing so those things i can do like after 12 i feel like editing i can do after 12 but the dishes and cleaning the house i will do like now it's not that much um but i think basically where i was going because i can feel myself losing like my third trail i think what i'm gonna do during this long period of low shedding i'm also gonna go working just around and see how many <laughs> calories i burn it's not gonna be much i'm pretty sure because i mean on the stepper okay the stepper ones are like really little but i'm not gonna focus on the calories there because it's all about toning because yesterday was like what 24 calories i lost in that 15 minute but it was a 15 minute workout i mean it makes sense but it was exhausting so it's like i don't want to focus on calories when it comes to that i want to just focus on toning and then when it comes to like the calories part that i want to make like a target and a goal i'll just do the working if i can i don't want to put pressure on myself i really want to try and do it i don't want to lie i mean one kg of fat is a lot like i could be snatched so quickly <laughs> you know so yeah um i think i'll do that but um as the week goes by 
I will see if I've reached the goal. I'm gonna try to keep track. Like I need to write that 24 from yesterday somewhere, and then I'm gonna write the 20 something for today as I'm about to hop on the stepper somewhere, and then do the walking, write those calories, and see how much excuse me calories I've burnt throughout the week, and see how I feel or if like there's any difference in the scale but if i didn't do that much working i don't feel like there's gonna be any okay there will be a difference but it won't be that much really i can't have like unrealistic expectations but yeah guys i've been blooding and twerking let's now get onto the stepper and get in today's exercise it's gonna be pretty much same thing as yesterday the 15 minutes but i'm not ready to upgrade i really thought first day i can start with the 15 minutes second day go to the 30 minutes no i can't no not possible so i'm gonna do my 15 minutes for this week and then when i feel that my body is catching on it's not as sore because it's also sore now so doing more would be a lot so yeah when i feel like my body is not as sore and it can take more minutes then i'm gonna keep adjusting as we go i mean i'm trying to make this a lifestyle so it's not like 20 minutes and then after 20 minutes it'll be like a done thing it has to be like an everyday thing or at least three days in a week thing where i know that okay i'm set on this specific time and then with time also i'm gonna adjust and like do my own things that i feel like i can try on this day but for now i just want to follow that girl's routine and keep it there basically so yeah let's get on the stepper i've been saying let's get on the stepper let's get on this Hey loves, welcome back. Today is Wednesday, day three of exercising and uh, it's literally midday, it's around one. I've been editing the vlog that you guys would have already, you would have already seen I'm in um, before this one and it took me forever to edit it. Like because I don't have space on my laptop, I literally had to edit in bits and pieces and then like save. Why are you looking at me like <laughs> And then like save like on the external drive that I used to record here and I couldn't um, work out or record anything because like space was too minimal um, that was left on the on the disc that I use here so I needed to like edit save on the disc and save on the laptop some footages and then compile the whole thing and then upload it like all together as save it I mean and then upload it all together as one video so it's like one i'm working out during the day but what else can i do i wanted to do like reels and stuff but i'll see if i do them i mean it's still one um so i think i will be able to do a few things here and there and with this um vlog i think i'm gonna fast forward a lot of footages because um like today's workout you guys would have seen it properly from the first day and then today i'm gonna fast forward because space and trying to make the vlog um a little bit shorter and not too long so yeah let's get exercising
Hey guys, uh, today is a Thursday and I'm gonna run late for work if I don't start working out now and I can't miss my morning workout. So I'm here to give you guys my morning workout. I think I'm getting used to the stepper, but not really. I'm still continuing with the same workout, which is 15 minutes. So I'm gonna try to chop chop and push that one and get it out of the way for today morning. Yesterday, the cut got full guys and it was dark. I don't know what was happening. Like the footage was dark, but it's there. I'm not gonna delete it because you guys have to say it. It's there. Um, and then like yeah the card was full so it cut me working out but I finished my workout so I paid my debt I paid my debt let's work out let's work out I did it. I go shower and get ready for work. I did it. Good morning. Good morning, my loves. I hope you are well today. Today is a Friday and it's around 10, so I'm not at the office, obviously. I'm not working anywhere, so it's like a Friday. Time is literally 10 past 10, and I'm only about to work out now because I needed to do other things in the morning. And today, I think, okay, I don't think I know. <laughs> today is the last day of this vlog, okay? I realized this vlog ended up being like, um, what do you call it? Like with a wellness or fitness exercise vlog, you know? So there was really nothing much happening other than me working out. And I think vlogging this first week like um, helped me to hold myself accountable to say that, okay, I still had a vlog and I need to finish it. So no matter how tired or lazy I am to work out, I need to actually get on the stepper and work out. <laughs> so this has been good for me in that regard to keep me in check and consistent. And today I'm about to get in my last workout for this vlog and then that will be it literally for this vlog um yeah i promised you guys that i was gonna cook we were gonna cook like you saw the first meal we had in the first half of the week but then um we didn't cook because today we are going home i'm going to my mom's my husband already left for work but after work he's gonna go to um his parents um tomorrow me and my family are going to his place because it's his mom's birthday we'll be celebrating this weekend so i'm not gonna eat <laughs> that good like the portions will be controlled because i already established that in my life and i feel like whatever i eat it's like i've been saying this <laughs> it's like i know when i have ingested like a good amount of like food like a good portion that is good for me um without actually calculating calories or anything like that so i will eat i will enjoy 
it's literally a birthday party i need to enjoy so yeah i will do that let me get in this work out and then yeah we'll be done with this vlog and uh i will see you guys on the next vlog i think i don't know if i should say my goodbyes now since i'm still gonna work out or work out and then come back to say um goodbye to you guys but hey um i think i should actually say my goodbyes now because i noticed when i'm vlogging i don't know what's happening it's like when i'm working out there the camera stops focusing on me and then it's dark it's just focusing on the lights but there are no lights now because i'm in low shading from 8 to 12 again so that's literally the story of my life as a south african or our lives as south africans <laughs> so yeah there are no lights i don't know how the focus is gonna go but to be safe let me just say my goodbyes now if you guys did enjoy this vlog please do give it a huge thumbs up and leave me a comment on the comment section down below let me know how you feel about it i think i'm gonna do more of these challenges just to challenge myself and just to get myself motivated but exercising has to be like a lifestyle is gonna be like a thing for me either a daily thing or at least at the most minimal will be like a three um three days in a week it can't be less than that so uh, that's what i'm planning to do like generally for my life you know but yeah if you did like this vlog again give it a huge thumbs up and leave me a comment on the comment section down below and if you haven't please do join my family if you like this content join my family and subscribe to my channel and be part of this family here on youtube i love you guys so, so much let's exercise